Here's how to delete iCloud downloads. Now there are a few different things that you can download to your iCloud. It might be taking up a bunch of space in your iCloud and you want it to find certain files or just bulk remove a bunch of things. I'm gonna show you your options. The first thing that you can do is go into the files app on your iPhone. So just open up the files app. If you don't have it, just download it and install it from the app store. And you can see at the very top is iCloud Drive. So I can tap on that and it gives me all the different folders in my iCloud Drive. I can go into this desktop here. Say you wanted to de delete a file from here and free up space. You can just tap and hold on any of these and then hit delete. And that will remove those files from your iCloud Drive. Now you might have downloaded these and then you wanted to remove them. Keep in mind, you can go to recently deleted here and you can delete them out of here as well. Tap and hold and hit delete now, delete. Now this removes individual files from your iCloud drive that you might have downloaded. But if you wanted to remove more, maybe app data or your entire storage, you can always do that as well. Let's go into your settings and tap on your name at the very top. Now let's tap on iCloud here. And then let's tap on this iCloud Drive right under Photos. Here you can see under Sync This iPhone is Manage Storage. I can tap on that 199 gigabytes worth of storage. You can hit this Delete Documents and Data. That will delete all of those documents and data associated with your iCloud Drive. It will remove everything. Keep in mind, you cannot get this back after you've deleted it. So you might want some of the documents in there. So this is one option. You can also just go back and back and then go to this iCloud backup. And potentially through here, you can delete this backup at the very bottom. You can see this Trevor backup. This is also on your iCloud drive. You can delete the, any backups. Maybe there are old backups that you don't necessarily use. They're not a phone that you have on our iPad that you have anymore. And you can delete them out of here and free up some additional space. Hope this helps. Do you have any questions on that? Leave them in the comments down below and I'll catch you on the next one.